Oh, I am absolutely knackered. I have been wrapping all these lovely presents over here and it feels like I've been going on for ages and my back is aching and I think I deserve a nice cup of tea. But it, oh, honestly, it just seemed as if there was a big mountain of presents to wrap. And I've got a big section over there for Adam and I'm keeping stum because I know he edits these so I can't say what's in them anyway. Um, but I've got everything for my nephew down here. Um, I've got a pile for his mum. I still have my dad to get for. Um, I've got my best friends and her little girl. Auntie Maureen's, I've bubble wrapped it because I've got her two things and I've bubble wrapped them both together so she can't tell what it is when she goes to feel them. So it'll put her off the shape, seeing as the obvious shapes when you obviously open them up. So yeah. <sighs> Hi guys, welcome to another vlog. Tell you what, it's been a busy week for me though. We haven't <laughs> vlogged loads, but we, we've we've tried. Um, but I've been busy editing, haven't I? I'm working yep. on a big project at the minute. Um, and I've only got a couple of weeks to get it done and it's gonna be one of those like really tedious jobs. Um, Slow going. I do enjoy editing, but sometimes when it's this intense, it's like, it's just very mundane. Mm -hmm. But you've gotta do what you can to pay the bills and whatnot. Yeah, exactly. So. That being said, take a look at what we've been up to this, this week. week, even though it might not be much. Right, I've just got the cups off uh, Adam because he's working late tonight. Thought I'd make him a cup of tea and myself after wrapping all these presents. So, keep the dog company as well. Because I've been having to uh, <laughs> give him all these... Uh, like offshoots of things that I've had. Oh, dropping things. Um, like stickers and waste, basically tags and all that type of stuff that you cut off just to keep them sweet. Cause obviously with me and Adam being both upstairs, it's really difficult to keep him entertained cause he doesn't like us both being busy at the same time cause he's not used to it. Are you? You're not used to being left out, are you son? Oh yeah, you don't like being left out. So Mammy's came downstairs so that I can basically keep an eye on her. And I'm managing to do this one-handed. Isn't that good? Shove that on. Oh, I didn't think I got to show you um, the few things that I've put out. My little snowman. It's for my birthday. Hey, <laughs> Christmas cards, snowman, Santa Claus. We have to keep moving them every time we want to go into the drawers. And then I've got my little train. And then seeing as the dog's going out, I can show you. I think I could get them open, that is. Oh, there we are. I've got my snowflakes on. Hey, no. <coughs> hey. <laughs> Just waiting for this kettle to boil. I'm hoping it's going to be quick because I've got a couple of biscuits that I can have with them. And that's to go in the bin. <laughs> Cup of tea. I'll not be long, like, because we've got the Walking Dead to watch. Don't yeah, we? we do. So I'm trying to finish for eight o'clock, like, as promised, though, right? Right. So I've just got to. Uh, I'll time you. Yeah. Little bit hard. Oh, don't time us. Every time I save, I'll go over by an hour or something. But yeah, I'm getting there with it anyway, so. Oh, good. Yeah. Uh, oh, God. It, he's someone come to sit. Come I don't. Jump up then, quick, and say hello before Daddy gets distracted. I don't know. I, I get this all day when you're at work, you know. How I've ever made a living out of being a video editor, I don't know. Because you, you just have this all the time. Little git, aren't you? Are you a git? Yeah? I better not keep saying that because he just keeps kissing us all the time. I don't know what that means to him. 
I think he thinks I'm paying him a compliment and I'm not. There's only little gits of stuff all over the floor that Mammy's had to pick up. And you're pinching the wrapping paper off Mammy, haven't you? He's looking at the night, like, shit, <laughs> Git. Yeah, daddy's little git do aren't you? Yeah? Daddy's little git. Right, it's dinner time and that can mean only one thing. It's Oliver's. Oliver's at dinner time. I go here every day as I keep saying all the time. Um, so I've had a nice salad uh, with grated cheese and pasta. So Hopefully that's going to be uh, filling a nice gap before I go back to work again. And by that I mean spending half an hour with the dog at the kitchen table and going straight back upstairs to the office. So I've got a big 4K project on the go at the minute and I want to get it done. It's Wednesday and I want to get it done by at least Friday at the latest. Spot on, can I have a bag please? There you go. Spot on, thank you. Spot on, thank you. See you tomorrow. So now I'm back home to eat my lunch. But before I do, I'm going to ring Auntie Moyne because I ring her every day just to make sure she's alright. So I'm going to ring her on the way back. Um, Sign in with her and see how she's doing. Right, I've got some headphones here um, that I've just been to get. Now let us explain, I got some Philips ones that I've just taken back. Um, I wasn't going to cover it on the vlog because they're a Christmas present for me mum, but she wants us to try them. So I tried them and they were absolute rubbish, right? It turns out they were analogue. Now the reason why I did get um, wireless headphones not Bluetooth is because I thought well I could use wireless ones on all the technology where you have to have a Bluetooth device so even though I'm getting them just for editing I kind of like thought oh no what if I wanted to use them on my iPod you know what I mean so I just thought right okay I'll 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 get them and it just didn't work it was like literally just oh there was a buzzing noise um that I just couldn't shake um and the problem is when you when you video edit and you work with a lot of like microphone, um, like inputs and stuff. And let's just say I needed to edit, I don't know, an audio track with two people talking. I couldn't do that if it was, you know, like it, th there was a hiss noise and I didn't, I wouldn't know if it was the microphone or whether it was the headphones. And I just can't work like that. So these are Sennheiser. Well, you don't really need to say anything else because Sennheiser is a great make anyway. Um, so, and they come with a nice little stand these at least anyway. So at least we know that we're getting quality. Sennheiser make really good microphones as well. So there's the headphones. Um, there's the lovely stand. And is there a plug? No. No, it doesn't look like there's a plug. So we've got batteries, oh there, plug there, batteries, I don't know what the batteries are for, but they'll probably be for, um, it's the only problem with biting your nails, you can't go in and out. Batteries, oh and you've got another phone or jack there, so that's nice. Right, set them out the way in a minute. Now one thing I've got to be careful with is when I'm opening things, you do have to return them. And I'm crap at uh, doing that. So, right, so, I don't even know where that goes, you know. It's, uh, I would imagine the batteries go into the headphones because it looks like the receiver's got something else. Yep. So, that's, uh, Try them on first though, shall we? And see what they like. Oh, they nice. They feel nice. Are they big and all? I'm looking in the reflection here with the mirror so I can see, but yeah, they, they're nice, huh? So 
So it's another Bluetooth receiver. Um, it has to be connected to my Mac. All right, so these go. These go into this headphone port down here. So they go into there. And then, see, I don't want to put that at the back of my Mac um, because I've got my me, me main headphones in here and I, I might want to keep them. So again, my cable OCD is going to play merry hell with that because it's like a big bloody cable. And they always wrap them up and tangle them up with like a little, you know, a little bit of uh, wire. And then that makes the wire not straight. And then it looks like that coming out of your computer. So even if I do like them, that's going to piss us off. All right, so I'm going to take this plug out as well. Hopefully it's a British one. Yes, it is, because sometimes, believe it or not, you get these European companies and they, they sometimes, you sometimes get a foreign plug and you've got to go an adapter, which I've never understood. Right, I'm going to have to pull all this out of here, so I can get in to the plug. Like, so. I just, want to I just want to show you something here, right? You know how OCD I am about my cables. Well, that's the reason why I have this under my desk, because look at that. Now, if that was on show, like that 24-7, I wouldn't be able to cope with it. So that's why this is there. That pushes back like that, and then it hides all your cables. So big up to anybody out there with setup videos and any other YouTube videos of people who do cable tie stuff under the desk so you can't see it. Cables do bother us, but I just can't be asked to go to that extent, so I admire anyone who does that. But as long as the out of sight, the out of mind. That doesn't sound right, does it? God, I'm not having much luck with headphones. So I'm on my way back now to take um, these Sennheiser headphones back. Because um, the base station's not working. Oh, it was working and now it's stopped. So I'm going back to Maplin. So that's two types of headphones I've had, which is uh, Philips and now Sennheiser. Now I do like these Sennheiser ones because when they were working the picture quality was really good. So I think I'm going to ask for another pair of these and hopefully it's not a fault with the model. Or at least that's what I'm hoping anyway. <laughs> Baffling because they're really good sound quality, mind. Oh, <laughs> and it's, it's actually like when I'm video editing on them, well, the bit that I managed to do on them before I cut out on this was uh, really good. It was really good, was it? It's a design floor, obviously. Oh, yeah, but like I say, as long as. As long as it puts in. I mean, how do you not know that you're not damaging that bit there at the end and shorten it out when you're putting force on it? Do you know what I mean? And I suppose like if we get this work and I hope I get it work when I get back. <laughs> just a nightmare. I just thought I'm mad destined not to have any video editing headphones or what, because it's like two different makes, isn't it? Uh -huh. I mean the other ones weren't faulty, they just weren't very good quality. Where well, these are excellent. If you get it work and in fact leave that in, <laughs> and I'll uh I'll just wire it in. And then when these are on, it should then charge. Yeah. Yeah. And I've read, I've read the instructions. It's, it's very bright light, though, so you would, you would definitely see it on. Because I wasn't convinced that I could get the cable all the way in because of how hard it is to get your fingers in. But mm -hmm. you know what I mean. 
Oh yeah. Um, just had to go up the shops to get um a parcel that I've received. Um, had to collect it because uh, they tried to deliver it like twice, and oh, yeah, the dog's interested. Yeah, it's not for you. Actually, I don't know what's in it, so it could be for him actually. Get down, you nosy. Oh, it is for him. He's going to get really excited if I bring them out and I show you them though. I'm going to have to do it sneaky. So the dog can't see it. I've got him a little tiger, which is quite cute. Ah, I got some Kong filler for him. So I can squeeze that into his Kong that he's got. And it's a... Uh, uh, liver which I think he'll really enjoy so I'll be able to take that out and have it what other ones have I got oh I asked for the grey oh yes I've got the grey one here well I've got a teddy bear here for him yeah go away dog go away <laughs> I got him a tigery sort of one in orange which I think he'll quite like yeah, not for you, dog. Go with. Ooh, I got him another Kong one, which is like a big one. And it's blue, so they're meant to be able to see blue a lot better than other colours. So that's what I got him. <laughs> and obviously I got him this tiger, which is so cute. Yeah, you, you're wondering what all these things are, aren't you? Not for you. But on the back, it shows you. Yeah, go away, dog. Uh, it's got knots in the middle of them so even if he destroys the outside of it he'll be left with raw which he enjoys tugging on anyway so i thought that would be good for him to keep i think that's really cute oh <laughs> what have i got Need for you what? for christmas lad you're not getting them what's it what's it <laughs> you have to wait till Santa comes. <laughs> yes, he's getting them done. Thanks, <laughs> you cute little bugger. Spoiled rotten you are, aren't you? Look at that little smile. He's, I know. It's almost like he's smiling at us. You smiling at Mammy. He wants his prezzies. Not for another you know, you know why? It's because he's used to getting everything he wants when he yes, wants. Yes, straight away as soon as we get in. That's why. And if you put them in that bloody top drawer, he's going to he's gonna be outside sniffing it because he knows... No, you can't have them. Get out. Get your head out. Bloody hell, man, doggy. He really is going to get them. God, what a week I've had with... Uh, these are great for editing with, by the way. But what a nightmare I've had with headphones. So, obviously, these are the, the Sennheiser... What I forget what you call them now. Sennheiser... Uh, RS120s, right? So, I've been using these for a day because the other pair that I had just stopped working. You've got a base station which you dock these to. Um, in fact, I'll show you. So there's the base station, and you put them on there like that, and then you'll see like a little red light, and then the red light also charges them. Cool there. Now on the other pair, th this green light here is always on when there's a contact, um, and it kept going off. Um, and the power supply at the back of this unit is absolute nightmare. So what I've done is I've threaded it all the way down. Um, all my cables out and underneath here like that but um, the problem is this has to be plugged into your headphone socket so obviously my headphone socket is here um, and that means I've got a cable coming down there which I absolutely bloody hate I tried putting it into my Scarlett USB interface but it's got a left and right channel at the back and I've only got one phono cable um, so that's not going to work so I've had a little bit of bother obviously I take them back get them replaced and I'm just testing it because I'm not sure if it's the actual model of the headphones like it could be a complete assembly line of the headphones that's just dodgy so I would like to have put it into my Scarlett USB interface but I would need a splitter to make it two channels but the problem is I've got them um, the, the, I forget what you call them them the speakers now uh, Harmston is it Harmston 
Harmston speakers. So you've got the two speakers up here, and then you've got the bass station that's in hidden out, out the way, which gives you the bass to the sound in my little cupboard down there. And the, the Scarlett USB interface doesn't power the speakers for very long um, because that's only connected via like a USB port. This, the, the, the Scarlett USB interface has got no power supply so that the computer powers it. So that was a bit worrying that I couldn't then put my headphones into the Scarlett USB interface and do it that way. And I went to all this trouble just to stop having to run that wire around the front which was a right ball ache. So I have no idea uh, how long this set setup's going to last basically. I think I might just get fed up in the end and just, you know, I don't know. Um, considering the wireless headphones, you've got a lot of wires coming from the base station that's on shore, which defeats the object of them being wired headphones, if that makes sense. Um, but I do love the fact that you've got no cables. Um, and when I get an email coming over there, I can just wheel across and still be listening to whatever I'm listening to. It really does help you immerse in your video editing. Um, I've never used headphones before, I've always used the speakers because the speakers sound excellent. But for the first time ever, I'm actually editing with headphones and I really, really like them. So I would seriously recommend doing your editing with a set of wireless headphones. Just hopefully you'll have more luck than I did with them. And there we are. Hello. So, another week gone. <laughs> another week gone. I tell you what, it soon flies round. Like we, we we start filming obviously tomorrow for next week's vlog. Yeah. And then the next minute it's like the weekend and it's time to edit it and stuff like yeah. that. On top of all the other editing that I do, but you know, <laughs> we like doing the YouTube thing though. We do. Um, but big respect to anyone who does the daily ones because I don't know how they do it. Do you know That'd what I mean? Be a lot of um, work. I mean, it. you know, just juggling it with your work life and when your work life is editing as well as editing vlogs, I think it's just a lot, like far too much to do. So anyone who vlogs uh, daily, uh, well done. That's t <laughs> some serious dedication. Definitely. So hopefully you like our weekly vlog though. Um, that's all we can give you, but obviously I've got more film reviews coming soon and more tech reviews coming soon. Mm -hmm. So uh, there's lots to look forward to onto the channel uh, as we approach the end of the year. Yeah, it's almost Christmas now. It is, aye. Uh, yeah, hence your Christmas wrapping at the beginning of this vlog. Yeah. But uh, yeah, so thanks for subscribing. Thanks for uh, liking the video. Please comment below and tell your mates and spread the word because iCouple rules, doesn't it? <laughs> so see you next week, guys. See ya.